Like, I finally remembered something that happened yesterday that it's also making me kind of depressed. So, I told you that I had contacted a trainer in Washington. Good morning, world. Good morning, internet friends. Good morning, everybody. Hi, guys. Hi. Hi. Anxiety when sleep is not your friend. We've been adding on to the list all day today. Good morning, internet friends. How are we doing today? I'm doing better than I was last night. Um, I've been noticing that whenever I get home from work, this has been happening for the past two or three days, maybe. Um, maybe that's another reason I vlog, is to actually record when crap like this happens. Um, that I get really, like, irritable, and I get much more depressed than I normally do. Like, it's like I hit major depressive episodes every night. So, yeah, there's that, but I think I'm doing better. Sorry that you're seeing mainly empty space. I kind of positioned the camera wrong. Oh, well. So, yeah, right now, and off to work. I got me a liquid breakfast, because I was kind of running late. And I didn't have time to pack lunch, so I'm going to be eating at the Gombe Cafe, which is a cafe that's at the zoo. And I get 10% discount which basically covers sales tax, so yay, no sales tax. <laughs> um, <but> yeah. <coughs> I just realized I forgot to take my beast bar this morning, and I forgot to grab it for the afternoon, so we'll see what anxiety does. Luckily, I know I won't get withdrawal symptoms, unless my brain decided to pull a weird thing and I don't know about it, but, um, yeah, we'll see what happens. So I want to just give you guys a quick check-in, say good morning, and I'll check back in with you later. Hey guys, so I've been home from work for like the past hour and a half. Really, Riddler, now is when you choose. Now is when you choose to be rude. Riddler, shut up, butthead. But, um... Anyway, the reason that I wasn't shooting for a while was because Major Depressive episode was really kicking in. And all I could do was just lay on my couch with my dog. I just felt nothing. I didn't feel tired. I didn't feel anything. I had no interest in doing anything. Just everything was gone. Um, and I forgot to mention part of why. the Like, I finally remembered something that happened yesterday that was also making me kind of depressed. So, I told you that I had contacted a trainer in Washington, because I heard she could do long distance help. She can't. She only does for locals. And she was like, oh, $14,000 isn't too much to raise for a dog. And I'm just like, you don't understand, ma'am. I don't remember if I put it in the email, but this person wanted me to get at least 7000 of that in, like, two months. And I couldn't do it. So, now I'm kind of frustrated, because again... I'm like, another opportunity has been slammed in my face. Should I even keep going for a service dog at this point? Because everything I've tried has failed. Um, I may start looking into programs that are out of state. Um, I don't know about talking to breeders or adopting. Because there's still the woman I know that breeds whinies, which is where Riddler came from. But if any of them are like Riddler, we don't need a second whiny to destroy a house. So... I don't know, there's that too, so, yeah, I guess this is just not my week this week, but I just wanted to give you guys that check-in and say that yes, I am alive, and I'll check back in with you later. Hey guys, so you might see I still might have a little bit of makeup on my face somewhere. Trust me, Tyler pointed out everything, but yeah, um, I recorded a new video that's going to be coming out on Monday, and I'm pretty excited about it. It's going to take a lot of editing, because I thought about getting it done and doing it tomorrow, but I'm like, no, I've already changed the date that I'm going to do it, and plus, just now. So, yeah, there's that. I've been getting really irritable today since I've been home. Like, in the evening, Riddler drives me crazy. Yeah, that cute little silver banana drives me nuts. And my brother drives me crazy with every little thing he does. And always being in my room. And always thinking that he could just come in my room whenever he wants. And that he could just hang out. No. 
I want my space to myself. <sighs> you guys who have siblings would understand this situation. It's like, you know you want your, sib your siblings want to hang out with you, but you want to be alone. I have been around people all freaking day. I do not want to be around people when I get home. <sighs> Apparently, that's too much to ask for. And of course, I can't talk to my parents about this because they'll be like, Oh, but your brother loves you and he wants to spend time with you. You don't get it. I am tired. I do not want to be around people and I don't want my brother just barging into my room like he can do whatever and just lay out on my love seat. No! Leave. Me. Alone. I just need to get that out of my system before I belt. Hey guys, so I've got chapstick on, contacts out, I got my meds taken, and right now I guess I'm okay. I'm still in a really cranky, irritated mood, but I'm feel I'm thinking that if I just go to sleep, I'll be better. So now I'm just gonna sign up for the night and head off to bed. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've had a wonderful day or night, rain or shine, whatever the world's got for you today. Question of the day is what irritates you? What gets you annoyed? For me, it is when Riddler is being a little butt face and when my brother's being annoying. So just leave your answers down below and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye!